Howdy y'all, Kang and Louie here, and welcome to another episode of Battle Brothers. When we last left off, we had somehow managed to grab a, not a victory, but survival out of the jaws of certain doom. So now we're just going to try to continue our luck, see if it holds, and go ahead and find ourselves a quest. And I think we're going to start with the same town we left off at, and there's nothing, okay. So we're going to go north <clears throat> to Edelshofen. Alright, not a bad place to go. I don't know what the footprints are. It might be a caravan, might be a monster, might be an orc. Who knows? Nope, just peasants. I think peasants got anything we want, maybe so we're just gonna leave them alone. Alright, another quest. Two skulls, but we have thrived off a of two skull quest so far. We, we don't die. You come across a man leaning against the porch post. He hails you down. Steinar of Adol Shulfin has been looking for you, Self Sword. He's down yonder in the village communal. The stranger nods towards a large building a little ways along the road. I hope you do good, mercenary. The people of Adelshofen are aware of your sort. Why would they be wary? I mean, it's not like we've just, you know, ditched caravans of people in the past. You know, it's not like those people were fathers or sons or anything. So, I don't know why they'd be wary. I have no idea. No clue. Insane, really. I hope you do good, mercenary. The people of Adelshofen are aware of your sort. Oh, wow, I read that. I'm all ears. Hey, our caravan. See, they still trust me. Brigands, whatever. Uh, two days. Let's talk money. I need to be paid more. See you on fifty. There you go. Is there your contract? Uh, leave. There you go. We're just on the way. We're gonna get paid six hundred fifty gold. It's something we need. We last for five more days at this rate. But it'd be nice to have a bit more gold. That way we can pay more men. And we're right by another caravan. We're no longer right by another caravan. We'll be fine. Well, no, 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 they're not ruins. We can go look in. Iron packs. Okay, I thought they were chasing me for a second. I was like, yeah. Are we going far north to, or, or not? I'm just going to stop talking. I'm just going to stop assuming. Well, they just sped on past, so I wonder what they've been chasing. So they don't speed on back, huh? Because we're right there. It would be a shame. Another battle site. Battle site's all along here. Oh, but we're here! Gold bro, 650 crowns, they're now well supplied, no problems along the road. Nobody can stop us. Let's see what's in gold bro. Uh, let's see, hire. Um, okay, we got Carl and Balin. They'd be nice. You have a sword, though. But you're expensive, so we're just going to hire... Let's hire Balon. We're, we're hoping for the best here. Um, Balon, you aren't really overly talented anything but oh well, that's not true you have some good stats in like defense maybe better with that uh, spear put you in the middle well no you already have you already have a spear we already got a spear you can have a wooden stick I think well hmm 15 25 20, we'll give you a spear we'll give you something we'll, we'll, we'll believe in you just this once all right, let's see what else we can get. Let's go to marketplace, and let's look at uh, what all we can buy. Ooh, we can buy a war forge. Well, that's really good, especially for you. That's really good. We'll get we'll get a war forge and we we'll get the core. It's a waste. Of, it's a lot of money, but I think it'll be worth it, especially since we're just gonna sell all this. All right, we need it. If we're in such dire, can I sell my spear? Ah, uh, not. Probably did though. Oh well. Okay, so now you are going to equip your Warfork, and we are going to be on our way. Less money than we came here with. For a one skull contract? You find Gutenberg, the counselor, talking to a group of peasants. Seeing you, he quiets them all down. Just a lot of you. The man here can solve all of our problems. The townsman takes you aside. Cell sword, we have a bit of a problem. There's a relic I need finding, some such thing by the name of Dice of Destiny. The Dice of Destiny. I don't really give an old god's damn about it, but these people worship it for spring rains and winter shelter. Always need the winter shelter. Naturally, it's gone missing. And for whatever reason, folks don't think it's gone off to a place by the name of Ancestor's Shelter, all and so on. Now, I'll go there, but you will, yes? For the right price, of course. I, I mean, we're, we're pretty much experts in going places retrieving them uh experts at the game of fetch 
So, 340 crowns, we need to be paid more. Be reasonable. Uh, <laughs> I accept this contract. All right, now let's see where we gotta go. Okay, so we ain't got we ain't gotta go too far south. We we should be fine on that. So let us get going. And so we don't run across those uh, brigands that we saw earlier. That would be very unfortunate. Might lose old Balon first day. What the? Oh wait, wait, wait. Speaking of old Balon, let's give Corey. There we go. I'm gonna give him that. That way he can at least throw a few rocks before they get rock him. You send a few of the men into the ruins to find the dice of destiny. All of them return in a hurry, which is unusual as they have a strong inclination to dawdle about to eat up sunlight earned an easy day's salary. Thankfully, one of them has a relic in hand. Unfortunately, they all look like they see a ghost. They need not explain the source of their horrors as a group of skittering, armor clinking undead emerge from ruins and level their spears in the way. To arms! Now, last time we ran, but I'm kind of curious to see if we could uh, take these guys on this time. <clears throat> I know it's probably not smart, but who needs that, huh? Right. Like, they can't reach us all at once, so we're just going. Hey, we hit them. Nah, I can't hit that. Well, here's the plan, all right? Oh, wait, armor's damaged. All right, they can probably move up two and hit us. So we're going to move back one and get ready. Can't hit? Nope. Oh well. Can't expect that, you know? Ah, uh, you can't move back any. Nah, we might as well swap to your spear at this point. Huh. Well, we've kind of ruined my plan there, buddy. Thanks for that. Oh well. That's alright. Hey, you hit him. Didn't do much damage, but you hit him. Let's move you up one, let's equip you with a Warfork, and let's have you do nothing. Ooh, the Cleaver. Alright. Whoo, that's a lot of damage. And he's gone! That's one down. Alright, let's move him back up. Uh, well, he can't do nothing. Alright, next move. Whoo, let's do some damage there. We need to get him away from the archer. Oh, well, I shouldn't have done that. Hmm. So I'm just hoping that he survives here, you know? We've gone through a lot of dead brothers. I don't, I don't want another one. Uh, okay, well, you got full thing. Let's see if you can. Quit. Well, no, let's not... Ah, it's too late now. Are you? Behead him! Try it again. Yes! He's done. Ah. Come on, man. Alright. Another brother down. Which one was that? Balon? You know, you, you win some, you lose some. Let's get him out. Spear, huh? Let's try to bust through. Not working. Let's equip your bow again. You need it. Uh, Alright. We're probably going to need you to run away while we deal with this guy. It's fine. You know, we can't all be superstars. We don't die. Yes, okay. He's going down next turn if we don't get rid of this one this time. Ah! There's some peace going on. He's going to die. That's definitely like. That's going to happen now. Oh no! He, I thought he was going to bleed. Alright! We lost Balog. Well, we just got him, but we lost him. Well, let's see what we got as loot. We got. Ooh, we got an ancient spear. That's what I see. An ancient sword of phallus. A good... We got three helmets. That's exactly what we wanted. So, yeah. He, he got a bit hurt. 
Uh, you take a look at the dice of destiny and at the men who attacked you over it. Or at least, you think they attacked you over it. The enemy lieutenant seems to have said something, but you can't remember what it was. Ah, well. Time to return to Gunbert, the counselor, and get paid. Let's get that money, money, money! Let's get you guys some actual protection. Uh, you. Yeah, you can go too. Uh, let's see. Which is best? 50. Okay. We need to get some tools next time we're in, too. I'm also going to equip you with the ancient spear. I'm going to equip you with the phallus, because that is awesome. And let's get you a better shield. Which means you get a better shield in reserve. Alright, there we go. See? No trouble at all. What do you have it? Okay, yeah. Okay. No trouble whatsoever. Perfect. So we're going to go back and we're going to go buy some tools with the new money we're going to get. Because that's something that we need more than, I guess, another man. Alright. Hmm. Gold Brook trading caravan we literally left like one of their citizens and as soon as we return oh yeah he's gone what happened to him? oh he's gone what sir what what happened I, it is what it is you know you gotta do what you gotta do um we have nothing we won't sell here well i guess we can sell one of our spears or a pitchfork but it's like eh, you know we might need that oh wait do us um, there we go. Tools, and uh, we should probably, we probably need some ammunition too. Alright. And while we're in the area, some food would be nice. Alright, leave. We have tools now. And, let's see, how much would round trees cost? 23? Come on! Hmm. Traveling merchant. Hey, everybody's in good spirits. We got the quest done. We can survive off this goal for hmm, one more day. We're going to need to go somewhere. Let's try to cut through the plains and go to, what's it called? Wild Burgessi, because we need the gold. We need the gold desperately. If we don't get it soon, we're going to start having desserts, and we have a few enough minutes to this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, you can go faster than that. Apparently you can't. Iron Pact, hey guys, how you doing? Just, hey, pass on by. It's cool, we're the Kingsmen, we're, we're brothers, yeah. All right. Ooh, last for, so this is like a full on citadel, and we can't accept the quest. But we can sell our spears for a little bit more. We need to sell one, we need to sell that. Uh, I'll sell the pitch one too, just so we have enough to last a few days. We can sell that too. We're gonna loot. I'm gonna go out uh, Gunstrom. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Is that the same guy that. No, no, that's the same guy. Okay. I think we can actually see, like. I know there's an option to see which of my brother. Here we go. Obituary. Oof. We lost Wolfgang first, then was Ferdinand, then Steinar, then Ruth Art, Hugo. Wow. Yeah, there's Dave. Brutal. Brutal. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, we left Bert went to die, didn't we? Oops. Oh, well. That'll be fine. Now we're going up to Phil's Wall, see if we can't find a quest up there amongst the snow and mountains. I'm sure we'll find something. I mean, how could we not? We're, we're very trustworthy. We're... We're here. We have weapons. And we're here. That's about all. Okay. That contract is locked too. So we're going to go south to Scottisdale. How are you locked in? I mean, we have neutral relations, so they shouldn't be locked. At this rate, we're going to have to go try to risk ourselves in like a fort or a know, ruins or something. But hey, day 16, we're still alive. If we gotta risk ourselves to risk ourselves, that's what we gotta do. Alright, let's go up to Skelliston. Alright, so we have some quests. Let's shout out this, uh, shout out the two skull one first. Okay, okay. Good times, Captain. What say you leave, take a leave from all the killing and dying? That would be nice. You raise an eyebrow at your response, which is precisely normal. 
which is precisely not at all. Huh, I figured you'd jump on that opportunity. No matter, it was a lie. <laughs> okay, I need you to take a certain package to Alberic of uh, Kaltenbach, a fellow residing in Kaltenbach. Hmm, that's a surprise. This cargo has undoubtedly garnered some ill-intentioned eyes, which is why I need your men watching it for me. If you're interested, which you should be, let's start with numbers. Let's start with money. 130 in advance, so overall about 130 in advance, 530 after, so overall about 660. Would you be paid more? That's more I like it. I accept. I accept the contract. About two days by road. Alright. It is now time to book it. We're gonna run to like some brigands or something, I'm willing to bet. But if we need whoa, actually hold on. Let's go back for a bit. Uh here we go. So that guy is a cripple. Go hard the cripple. Which means he's always content and being reserved, but he has a hate for beast and he has hand to have time. We're gonna give you something. We're not gonna leave you alone, per se. But if push comes to shove, uh, yeah, we're running and you're staying, and that'll be that. Let's get you some fair look. There you go. Nah, nah, this is more like it. Alright. Alright. Now we'll leave. And now we will head to Kaltenbach. And if we run into some brigands along the way, we'll have somebody behind try to head them off at the forward, you know? Try to keep them there. A distraction, if you may. Till then, we're just walking. Through the ghost hills, through the crags and the plains, through oh, 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 Man, that's a crypt. The crypts usually have kind of weak enemies, if I remember correctly. Maybe weak enough for us to actually take on on our way back after we have a few more men. Because right now we only have six, and I do not feel confident, and I don't feel that confident in my skills. But through after going through the woodlands. Battle sites, swamps, past crypts and fortresses, we are almost to our destination. The grand journey which you will never hear about. We are almost there. Even more south. Lord of the Rings has nothing on our brave band of adventurers. The six men who have risked life and limb time and time again. And more losses and wins, I admit. But we're here. And, and it wasn't that bad. It was like, it was like a stroll. Two day stroll. We got paid 508 crowns to, to go walk. Hey, take what you can get, right? After some looking, a man asks who you're looking for. Oh, cool, thank you. When you say Alberic of Kaltenbach, he points you out towards a nearby paddock where a man is strutting about on a rather opulent looking horse. Ooh, opulent. You walk on over and the man rears the steed and asks if that's the cargo Erland the Guildmaster sent. You nod. Leave it there at your feet. I'll come and get it. You don't. Instead, ask him about your pay. The man sighs and gestures to a bodyguard who urges over. Uh, see to it that this silver sword gets the pay he deserves. That kind of sounds like a threat to me. Finally, you put the crate on the ground and make your leave. You gain 580 crowns. Crowns well deserved. Well, gonna be honest, not really. I mean, we don't really deserve those crowns. We kind of just... That's all we did. And, but hey, you know, payment's payment. Let's look at the next contract. Burkhard the Younger. I'm not lit. Are y'all remembering these names? Because I'm sure. Like, I'm, I'm hearing, I'm reading them in the quest, whatever, and they're just like, oh, cool, cool. Man. That's it. It's in one ear, out the other. I'm, I, it doesn't matter. Burkhard the Younger is looking at a poorly drawn map, then looks up at you as though you're the one responsible for making it. How dare I? Look, mercenary. This is a strange thing to task you with, but you seem to have a good head on your shoulders. See this dark spot here? Would you be willing to venture that way and try to find the abandoned strong? Okay, so it's... Alright, it's in the Oakwood Meadows. For the right price, I need to be paid more. Alright, cool. 310 gold. Or crowns, or whatever kind of contract. But if they don't accept gold, what are they doing? But more importantly, we have a guy with a bow, Grimwall. A poacher. Now that is what I'm talking... For the longest time, I thought this was like a just very oddly shaped foot that little icon right there next to his name but it's a rabbit i don't know why i thought it was a foot or something like that it's just very strange all right i'm hiring him we have another archer um how good is this archer whoa he's got a wonky bow that's uh, i don't know why i'm excited but he has one all right 
Uh, we're gonna put you on the side. But hey, walking boat. He's not even good at archery. He's just there. All right, here's what it is. Uh, we will now take our leave of this great, fascinating, amazing, incredible yada 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 town, and we will head towards the Oak Wood Meadows east. Huh? All right, so it's like right over here then, east and around the region of Oakwood Meadows. Abandoned stronghold. Let's see if we can't find it. It's over here. In the east of the meadows. No. Okay, let's go. Well, let's, let's camp at night, because I don't think they can really see that well during the darkness and all that. We might just walk on by it, and then next thing you know, we're here spending three hours. All right. So let's go. Okay. Nope, no, 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 no. Have a good day. Uh, bye, bye. Hmm. Two arms. We are going to run because those are bringing. Oh, they got axes too. Wait a minute. Bringing thug, bringing thug, bringing thug. These guys are just thugs. I ain't worried about. Well, I say I ain't worried about thugs. Hmm. We do need better gear. Uh, how about we do this? How about we move back to... Well, no, you can't take a... Okay. How about this? I'll just shoot and see how much damage I do. Okay, it's have to. Yep, nope, we're leaving. See you later. Smell you later. We don't want it. Oh, uh, retreat. Yep, retreat. I didn't see him. I did not see him. He was non-existent, I swear. That brigand raider right there with all the armor in the world. I don't want it. Ah, uh, Adler. Oh, no, he's dead. Oh, he's really dead. That's a shame. Oh, wow. What are you doing? No. Ah, dang, I thought they were retreating in the right direction. But now these guys are going north for some reason. They're going to get caught. Oh, well. We're running now. What are you doing? Oh, that's a pretty good look. But hey, we escaped. Mostly. Rest in peace, huh? The cripple's still alive. Did you catch up to him? You caught up to him. I told you not to run that way. What'd he do? He ran that way. Nobody ever listens. Never listens. But he may have gotten away. I don't we don't know yet. He's just kinda just kinda vibing. Just kinda doing his own thing at his own pace. Alright, Adler is short, dead. Hey, rest in peace, buddy. That happens to the best of us. Ah, but he took the good cleaver with him. That's a shame. But we're going to push him. Well, good ours. Oh, wait, he didn't take the good cleaver. It was just one of the bowmen. Now, whatever. Whatever. That happens. Anyway, we're retreating back to the place. Um, alright. Now we're back in action. A temple. A refuge. You have no one in your ranks. I'm intrigued here. Okay, that's good enough. Um, leave. Leave. Okay, so the brigands are that way. A traveler carrying a oh no, a traveler carrying a car of personal goods heads your way. You let him approach, holding your hand up to warn him to go no further. He says that he's a simple wanderer and that he's only looking to get to Shoffer State. First showing that he's completely unarmed, he asks if he may stay the night with your company. Why not? Join us at the campfire. You sit around a fire. Much talk is made about this or that, but the traveler does speak some words which reside within your mind long after he's gone. The battle of many names. Who did not take part in that? Half the world was on the march then, I swear it. I stood with the infantry. Footmen to a lord, to be precise. Protected him well after the orcs released the berserkers. After that, everybody sought to protect themselves, a job which proved quite difficult. I used to lie about how I made it out. Now I don't. The truth is, my lord had his face crushed by a chain, and his mount flipped and fell atop me. His poor heart struck dead in fright. Then what happened? The driver pauses, staring into the campfire. He prods the edge of it with his stick. That's the last thing I remembered as far as the fire was concerned. I eventually woke to the rains coming up to my nose. They nearly drowned me in my dozing. I wiggled my way out from under the horse and crawled to God knows where. Orcs and men lay everywhere, dead, dying, drowning, lots of screaming. Couldn't tell who or what it was coming from. I remember the mud. I remember it clutching at me. A bait, strong arm like an ox, saved me from it. She 
threw me on a cart, and the last thing I saw was the battlefield. And I'm sorry. I must stop. Thank you for having me for the night. May you find peace on the road, Mr. Traveler. That was interesting. It's just, like, I, I didn't get... That's one cool thing about this game. One thing I, I kind of really like about it. That had no bearing. You watch as the stranger comes to the light of the path, shielding his eyes so as to keep as much of his face hidden. You look like the sort to be in search of something, but you know not where to be. The bandit stronghold is tricky like that. Good thing I know where it is. Good thing you too can know where it is by sliding 30 crowds my way. I'm the fastest spurring you ever did see, so don't try ringing out me one of them shiny swords you got. No need. We'll find our own. I'm not, I'm not wasting my crowns. Look at how small these meadows are. Ah! No, 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 no. Get away. Get away. Get away from me. No, we don't want... We, we're good. Stay. Stay there. Stay back. We have swords. Alright. Let's go to Wahlberg. It's now dawn. Let's go to the marketplace to buy some food because we're almost out. Alright. I should have asked. I should have found out where it was. Let's wait a little bit for the brigands to leave, and then we're going to go back up here. Alright. It's now day 20 and midday. The brigands are probably gone. Uh, did we find it? There was a command spot. Let's get away from there. Man, why is everything out here trying to kill us? I don't understand. Alright. Uh... Okay, hey, hey, you show a group of world-weary explorers. They see us up in the middle of the road, half covered in mud and half in leaves and all in unintentional camouflage. One rubs his forehead, eyeing you carefully for a smile widens. Hey, I know a searcher wants to see one. You're in for the abandoned stronghold, ain't you? Well, you're in luck. We was just coming from there. Here, give me your map and I'll show you where it is. You see, on the plain somewhere in northeast of where you are now. Much appreciated. Thank you. Exactly where I, I thought it... Oh, wait, is it past the swamp? Where are you doing? Why are you sitting there? It's past the swamp, ain't it? Yeah. I didn't think that counted as... I would never found that. Well, I never found it. Oh, well. We found it! That scared me. <laughs> we found it, okay. Uh, we might return there later, but for now, let's get on back to Kaltenbach before a whole bunch more brigands surprise us. See, everybody's neutral now. Everybody's, you know, I mean, people die. We've all seen them before, so they're, they're settled. They're happy now. We're no close to our goal of having a roster of at least 16 men, but, you know, it will be one day. No, actually, no, we're one man closer. This is like a starting quest. Of course, that's where it is. He smirks and pay you what you're sitting owed. Grounds well deserved. Let's see if we can recruit anybody. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll take this guy. Eduard? Yeah. Hi. At this point, we're just trying to get men. We're trying to get by so we can finish the starting quest of the game. And once we finish, it'll be great. Alright, you stay on the side there. Alright, ooh, wait, you're really good with a bow. Um, actually better than the poacher, which is astonishing. And, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna swap. Nah, I can't do that, because you got the, you got the poke poke. But I will swap your weapons with this guy. Bada bing. Boom. Uh -huh, boom. Bada bing. Take away your arrows. You don't need them. And swap. All right. Well, with that, I think we're going to call it a day on this episode. Uh, we survived multiple brigand attacks. Well, most of us survived multiple brigand attacks, but that's not important. The important fact is we're still alive. It's day, what day is it? It's day 21, and we're still here. We're still alive. We're still thriving. We're still breathing. We're still having a blast. And so we'll be keep, keep on having a blast in the next episode. I hope you have a wonderful time watching this one, and hope you have a wonderful day. Goodbye.